What's going on guys? Andy here, Cut and Clean Lawn Care. You think my YouTube career is just hopeless. I hope for this. You see my subscribers go up and you are so pissed. You better jump on board because I'm a blow quick. When it thumbs down or show his neck and I'm a choke it. And you can hit us up on Snapchat like we on there. We're always grinding, shouting out to ring lawn care. He's crawling when it's snowing, cutting clean is always going. And I wasn't planning on doing any mowing today, but... My wife woke me up this morning, told me one of her friends, that's not too far, only a couple minutes away here in the neighborhood, uh, their mower broke down. So, being the nice guy I am, you know what? I said I would go over there and cut it. So she's actually going to help me do that. And we're also going to mow my neighbor's yard because she's been out of town. And I'm going to do that for free just because we're nice people. So yeah, we're going to knock that out. I'm going to do some filming for you guys. That's the key, man. Even if you are a business owner, and you know everything is about money because that's why we do what we're doing, it's okay to still be charitable, man. My neighbor's been out of town. She's a really nice lady. She's become friends with my wife. I have no problem just going over there, knocking it out, making it look real good before she comes back so she'll have time to unpack and do all the other stuff she needs to do. And like I said, then we're going to go to her uh, friend's house whose mower broke down. Won't be doing that one for free because they got to travel there. But I'm not going to highball them. It's not going to be expensive by any means. We're just going to get it done, guys. That's what it's all about. So here comes some random clips. Moving the stuff around like always and some mowing action. So let's do it. Now this is one of those properties where it's a guarantee that you're going to have to clean your mower deck out multiple times. I think I did it three to four times on this property. When the grass is this thick and wet, there's no way around it. guys so we got a problem not only the fact is it really tall and wet which isn't a big deal that's cuttable but I have my wife helping me today and she's already broke something so that doesn't take very long but it's cheap stuff anyways 
one of the clips on the chute broke. Some redneck engineering. Right here. Will it reach this high? Look, you got a hole right there. No. No. Little bell on you. There. Kind of sketchy. There's a good chance I can fly back and smack you in the face. There's a good chance I can fly back and smack you in the face. It almost did whenever it broke. Is that like the going thing though for a business owner where no matter who it is, the help always breaks your equipment? So as you can see in the title, this is tall, wet, and thick, for real. That's the second time I've had to clean out my mower deck. A little bare hands action ain't gonna hurt you. But yeah, it's not bad at all, so just do what you do, man.